Hello grade one. Now this video is done to explain the evaluation test you are going to take uh, after uh, for the fourth week. Now here we have of course the first thing you have to do is to write your name at the top of the page and uh, the class. Are you in group one or group two? Now let's move to the first exercise. Here you have to tick either true or false. And so here we have 10 sentences about this. Now you look at the different pictures and you have to choose either true or false and you put a tick on the right frame, on the right square. Now I read for you the first sentence. This is my dad. So you look at the picture. Is it true or false? This is my mother. True or false? Then we move to sentence three. You look at the picture. This is my sister. True or false? Here, this is my family. For five, it is a fish. Six, it is a bird. Seven, it is a parrot. Then here, look at this picture. The cat is in the kitchen. Is it true or false? For number nine, the rabbit is in the kitchen. Is it true or false? And ten, this is my parrot. It is green and red. Is it true or false as well? Now we go to exercise number two. So it is here six points. So what do you have to do here? Read and tick the right alternative. So this time where you have these dots, it means that there is a word that lacks. Here you have either to choose in or on or under. Now look at this picture. What can we say? The cat is in on or under the box what about number two the apple the apple is in on or under the book then for number three the fish the fish is in on or under the box again for the fish are the aquarium in or on or under for five, we have the cat is on the table, on the chair, or on the box. The last one, six, look at that man. The man is under the table, under the chair, or under the box. Then finally, for we have exercise number three, we have here four points. First thing, trace, so you have to follow the dots and write again the words. So we have father, sister, kitchen, and living room. And after you follow the dots, you trace here. Then you write once, only one time, here, where we have the blank lines. Now, I hope that this video will help you. Uh, good luck and nice work. See you.